Carl wearing the Apollo Creed, American flag shorts. Ladies and gentlemen, introducing the fighter out of the blue corner, standing five foot 11 inches tall, weighing in at 159.2 pounds. With a perfect record of two wins, zero losses, fighting from Inferno MMA from Bentonville, Justin Black Panther Jones. Justin Black Panther Jones. Like I said, both these guys 2-0. And, oh. and his opponent fighting out of the red corner, setting six foot tall, weighing in at 159 pounds with a perfect record, two wins, zero losses from West Side MMA from Little Rock. Kyle Thompson! A lot of love for Kyle Thompson. Nathan Kirby coming up saying this one's going to be fire, and I have to agree. Like I said, Kyle Thompson with the Apollo crew. Ooh! Ooh. Right for the head kick and going right for the double leg. Got his hands glass, and Justin's taking a ride. He's about to take a ride. Oh! Beautiful slam by Kyle Thompson. And Kyle's wasted no time to put down the fury on him. A little Matt Hughes-esque yeah. body slam there over the shoulder. He used to carry their opponents around and do a little show mm -hmm. and then the slam. That was a good miss. I mean, what I mean by that is uh, Kyle threw a big old head kick and Justin was uh, smart enough, quick, quick enough to evade it, but couldn't defend the takedown. Right now, Nita Belly, half guard. Full mount, Full man. mount, what am I talking about? Oh, and Kyle's putting it down on him quick right now. Justin's got to, he's giving up his back. Kyle Thompson showing that experience. Both these guys 2-0. and oh. Kyle's a heavy wrestler. He's got great position. And then added with the damage factor that's the key is being able to get yourself into a position using wrestling to trap an arm and then do the most efficient and effective damage possible he's doing a good job to do that without giving up the position too and as i say that justin been a beautiful knee and Man, right back to that double leg movement. and justin's going for a ride again that was beautiful man slipped right under it i mean he knows it's coming it's just when right you're back to mount when you are a wrestler, you are so used to your wrestling being so dominant that people do anything they can to hit you. <laughs> and so you just got to wait one split second and slip it, roll it, and take him down anyway. This is the second time I've seen this tonight. You see his underhook grip. He's controlling him from underneath. Oh, flatten him out with a right rear choke. Right him out. It looks like it's under the chin. And Justin's about that's to it. tap. And th oh, yeah, there's it. the rear naked choke finish from Kyle Thompson. What an amazing Pyramid Fights debut for Kyle Thompson. Impressive, impressive victory. He threw that head kick. Like Kirby said, Justin was able to evade it, but Kyle went right for the double leg and had two impressive slams in that fight right there. He was able to go to mount with both of them and was easy to get, you know, uh, was, was putting great, great ground and pound down on Justin and made Justin give up his back, flatten him out with those hooks and finish with that rear neck and choke. Right now we're seeing some of the action right here. This is where he gets both those hooks in, does a good job of flat adjusting out, and went right for the neck. And you can tell right there, usually it, it's, it's gonna be hard to get out of a submission like that, especially so early in a fight when both guys aren't as slippery and you know as wet as they can be from sweat. Kyle was just on him from the jump. Right there's that head kick and just barely missed, but like I said, he was really wise to immediately go for that double leg. Ladies and gentlemen, two minutes into the first round, we have your winner by tap out from a rear naked choke, Kyle Thompson! Kyle Thompson with the huge finish. Destiny's giving him his pyramid medal.